Hey everybody, welcome back. Uh, I kind of skipped a couple of the Summer Servants when I was uh, making this series, but realistically there wasn't much to talk about with them, so I don't feel like I'm missing much. There was one that maybe we'll revisit again, but for this series in particular, uh, I just skipped the other two. Yeah, they're just kind of, you know, they're, they're, they're it, it, maybe I'll go back and do them at another time because I have those recordings still. I think my audio is still kind of scuffed on those, but we did just get a brand new servant on JP, and uh, it is now my canonical evil daughter, uh, who I'm adopting. She is my baby. Kazura Drop. Uh, Kazura Drop, if you don't know, is one of the most terrifying creatures in the entire Nasuverse, hands down. And you can tell just by looking at it. Right? This thing exudes horror and evil energy. Like, d d is this not the most evil thing you've ever seen in your entire life? Even if she is the most evil thing ever, that duck is still fly as fuck. Third Ascension, I like this one a lot. This will probably be the one that I use. Oh, there it is. Then her final Ascension, look at this demonic thing. Absolute menace to society, war criminal. Anyway, let's take a look at what she does, shall we? Kazura Drop uh, is a five-star alter ego. She has max HP, 13,822. Max attack, 11,220. Not bad. Not bad at all. She's a quick, quick arts, arts buster. Okay, I don't actually know what her card type is yet. My prediction is that she's going to be quick. I get a feeling that she's going to be quick, but I could be wrong. All right. Buster... Uh, four hits, arts, three hits, quick, four hits, extra five hits. Pixie... Pixie Finger. Okay. Chat, you ever gotten your... <laughs> you ever gotten your Pixie Fingered before? <laughs> Alright, this is a 20% drain from all enemies, or just get rid of one charge for all enemies. Uh, apply. Cast an effect up... Okay, so just... Uh, buff success rate up for negative buffs okay and then a refresh thing that is art resist down wait what the fuck hold on no quick resist down and then resist down versus crits it makes them more susceptible to crits okay interesting yeah that's uh and it applies it's a two times it does it two times. Okay, interesting. Interesting skill. Six turn cooldown. It just makes it so that she's going She's going to let 50% on both those is really high, too. Okay. Skill two. Sakura Eater. Ladies, you ever had your Sakura eaten before? Anyway. Charges NP for self by 50%. Gotta have that. Okay, can't leave home without your 50% battery. Gain NP... Okay, that's fucked. That, that's... NP target sum to self. It's up to 5,000 plus 4. This is fucking with me. If function number 2 fails on any target, reduce cooldown by 1 for self. I don't... Alright, chat, help. Something to, do, something to do with the new Sakura AI trait? There's a new AI trait. I don't really understand this. But, I mean, it's a 50... It's a, at, okay. If nothing else, it's a 50% charge and it has the potential to reduce the cooldown, possibly by 2 if I'm understanding this correctly. No, it's only by the 1. It, with a cooldown reduction, so it's essentially a 5 turn 50% battery. That does something additional, which is not bad. Alright. And now for the third skill. Remove, a, remove a, effects with negative... Okay, just clear all debuffs. Okay. Restore HP for self by 5,000. Apply the class change. Class change. What what class does she change to? Change to the same class of the enemy selected. Excuse me, what the fuck? <laughs> she can take the class of whoever she's fighting 
And that reduces their defense down by 50%. That sounds broken. Uh, I don't think it's broken. Passive is important for this. Okay. Uh, I'll look at the passive now then, just, just for that. Hi, Servant. Glad they've still never done fucking anything with this. Uh, special damage ha- hold on. Oh. She gains class advantage. She gains 75% more damage against units that are of the same class that she is. Meaning that at any point in time then, if I'm understanding this correctly, she is just the ultimate alter ego killer. Because I would assume that this is this is always active until she changes, right? It, she wouldn't need to have her thing be changed. And also 30%... <laughs> this is great. 30% damage against any uh, Sakura type units. That's really fun. Okay. 175% damage, bro. It's only, it's only 75, but yeah. That's... Okay. And now... She's, she's quick, right? Fucking of course she is. So we found the savior of the quick, of quick then, right? We found the quick savior. The fucking bug. The bugs are back! And I, I was gonna assume she was AoE, yeah. What are her components again? Is Murian, I think? I don't, I don't know. She's new. She's new, so I don't know what her components are. Wait, that's not true. They they, they had a thing for that before. I'm fucking stupid. These characters existed before FGO. I'm just an idiot. I'll look into that later. It is an AoE. Quick. Four hits. Yeah, I, I know I'm stupid. I know I'm stupid. No one can tell me I'm stupid because I'm more aware than anybody else in this room that I'm stupid. <laughs> It has an attack down by 20% for all enemies, applied defense down by 20 by up to 40% for all enemies, and then chance to stun by 40. Eh, it's whatever. It, that can be useful, but it's not the best thing in the world. Actually, hold on, that's not true. It's a 70% chance up that they can stun, so it's a more than half of the time. Still a little bit inconsistent, but workable. Okay. Decent damage. The, the 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 bug system is real. The bug farming system is very real. So single target, ignoring the plus four, could mean percent times number of Sakura AI. So three three thousand equals th three thousand percent, or three times number of or sorry thirty times number of Sakura AI. Gotcha. Interesting. Her components are apparently Murion and two unknown goddesses. That's not ominous at all. The intelligence seeds fast, but I am more fast. Alright, and what else? What are your other passives? Uh, Territory Creation EX, pretty good. Magic Resist A. And you are... A, I, I wonder. Hmm... <laughs> Why on earth would this be a thing? Now we saw your traits already. Female, alter ego, earth, lawful good, lawful, lawful good, lawful good, lawful good, hey, lawful good, lawful good. Five star servant, servant, fey, humanoid, weak to, lawful good, fey, uh, humanoid, weak to enema, lish, or sky or earth servant, sky or earth except pseudo and demi servant, child servant, has costume, uh, Sakura AI can be in battle. So is there any servant that doesn't have a self trait? Uh, and then Ascension 1 and Ascension 2 both have summer mode, which is relevant for a couple of people. And then she needs. She's caster and assassin. And then she needs thread and dust. Uh, she's not that hateful. I mean, this is the worst part, right? It's just the, like, the, the, the new bronze mat is gonna kind of suck to get but other than that that's not or it's, that's a silver mat it's not the worst thing in the world that could be worse and these will probably be available so you know she's so evil that, that she cheats her own trait i wouldn't be surprised that her growth curve is okay yeah, it's decent profile she hates us <laughs> 
Chat, my daughter's going through a difficult phase right now. Why do Except I here's the thing. About her alignment? Here's... Look at her, she embodies lawful goodness. Uh, this is the most lawful good thing I've ever seen in my entire life. Uh, here's the thing. She just hates you at first, and then afterwards she's just like, Alright, you're my papa. <laughs> she's, a, she's a pushover, is what I'm getting from this. Is she's a massive pushover. Strength E, Endurance E, Agility C, Magic B, Luck C, NP, EX. True. Divinity None. I thought she had two goddesses. Okay. She's like Kama? Yep. And then Assets. These are all very cute. Oh, she sits in the middle! <laughs> oh, she's so cute! Look at her! You can't have her pancakes and she wants it all after you did so. She's so small! Yes, this is the costume. God, Wada Arco with the blessing. Wait, how small is her sprite? That's a good question. I wonder if they'll change the... No, because she's... she's pet, pet, sorry, in. Please she, not she's child-sized. No, she's child-sized in Lost Belt 6. That's a big fucking flower then? Well, she can... No, because she can change sizes, right? That's her whole deal, is that she can change her size. Like, that's why Murian is so scary, is because Murian can actively change the size of herself. Did you know, chat, a Murian is a real fairy? And that Murian are, uh, called that because that is, I believe, the old Welsh word. No, it's the old Cornish word for ant. And it was believed that these fairies were able to grant wishes, but each time that they did so, they shrunk until they were the size of an ant. So it was considered a it was considered bad luck to kill ants because you could be killing the fairies, which would get you cursed. Can she change the size of things as well? That is correct. That's why she's so scary. That's why people don't. That's why Morgan doesn't fuck with her. Is because Morgan's like I could probably deal with her. But she is going to be annoying, and it's going to cost a lot of resources, so I'm just going to not deal with it. Until she's smaller than Habitron. Look, we'll have to see the sprites in-game. Uh, maybe I'll boot up a thing and do that here. That's adorable, and I love that. Alright, now for the most important questions. Expressions. The fucking mouse hold ass. Wah! <laughs> Wah! Oh my god. Little pout, big pout, sad, weeping, happy weeping. What? Uh, blush in open mouth. Non blush angie. That's a scary face. Eepy. She got the eepy. Oh god, she got the Nagatoro face. She has, she has various levels of panic. <laughs> she has ascending the levels of have PTSD. panic. I mean, she is a bug. <laughs> this is still the scariest face. This one is like meant to be scary. This one is scary. This one's also kind of scary. This is just the pathetic. God, she's so baby. We are we send hi. Okay, so she does get new expressions with... Okay. They're mostly the same. The pout stays, which is impor important. This is an important pout. I love that she has multiple where she's just, like, serious and then just turns to tears. And then you gotta keep the blushes. Okay. And then for Murion... Yeah, duh, 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 duh. Don't worry about these. Don't worry about these if you've not read Lost Belt 6. This is, this is okay. She's fine. Uh, good, uh, sad, uh, worms, and worms. Okay. That's just catch it. She spilled her, yeah, she spilled her, her classic British dish, the uncooked meat pie. The moth smiles. I like this expression a lot. That's cute. Wada cooked. She cooked. She cooked so fucking hard. Goddamn. Alright, so overall impression, back to like the thing at hand, uh, she seems 
if I'm understanding her correctly, I'm still kind of confused on her second skill. She seems like maybe the most versatile quick farming unit that has ever existed. Know what I mean? She, if what she does is how I understand it, she can just you can you can effectively bring her to everything and she will be good. Like any node where it's going to be uh, taking her against. I mean, just like like most most like farming nodes for most things, where it's just like it's all archers or it's all assassins, and you're always just like. To keep changing up my fucking team. I don't want to keep using my fucking berserkers for this. And she's just like, I'm here. I can take care of this shit for you. Yeah, uh, I am. I'm a big fan. So they gave us a busted quick single target in OC2. And now we have the new best quick farmer. Essentially, that's, yeah. Can she be a beast? Uh, no. I don't think so. Glory to quick? Yeah, uh, she might be one of, if not the best quick servant in the game presently. Quick Farmer. I should specify Quick Farmer. Uh, she seems like she might be revolutionary to the to the genre of quick. I mean, people are just going to laugh laugh her off and be like, she's a quick... I'm sure that there's a single person in my chat in my Discord right now who is saying that she's going to be a... She's a bad servant because she's quick, and that's the only reason why that she why she's bad. And if you truly believe that a servant is bad solely by card type, I don't know, reevaluate your priorities, experiment more. There's poor there's more to life than Castoria. There's more to life than Koyan. Quick isn't as bad as you think it is. It's just more difficult. I understand that it like requires the neurons in your brain to fire a little bit harder than you like them to. However, it's good exercise, you should do it. Uh, and then one last thing before we go. It's, this is the Sugoroku boar that we will be playing on, uh, in the event. I am so excited for whatever the fuck is going to happen with, um, her valentine. Uh, and, oh, the G-Man is buff. We'll look at that here in a second. For now, though, uh, I, I like her a lot. I like her a lot. I'm gonna give her an EX tier. She seems EX. I could be completely off base. I will play around with her a little bit more, but just looking at her up front, she seems like EX here. Insanely powerful unit. I'm looking forward to using her. Anyway, thank you guys for hanging out. Uh, for those of you over on YouTube, hi, come check out the Twitch stuff. Alternatively, check out the Patreon, check out the podcast, do all that stuff. We got Discord, we got uh, subbing on the YouTubes, which you should do if you're not already. Do all the YouTube stuff, keep a chin up, lads. Peace out. Bye-bye.